cultural contribution also exists in their food, like this satay. Aha, satay rambige! Like most food in Lombok, Sata Rambige, also named after the village where it came from, Rambige village. The signature of Sata Rambige is that they don't put sauce on top of it, like most satay in Indonesia. They actually marinate the sauce into the meat and then they grill it. The sauce is a mix of sweet soy sauce, garlic paste, brown sugar, fermented shrimp paste, chili and dash of salt. The meat used is a fillet steak, cut into squares and thrust with skewers and marinated in the sauce for at least 30 minutes before being grilled. Mmm, that's a mouth-watering satay right there. Let's see. Mm. Oh my god. This is so good. I'm not even joking. Oh, it's so sweet and spicy. It's so tender. The meat is so tender. Mm. They serve it with a rice cake shaped like mini cone. How to tell a good rice cake is that if you smell it, it smells good, like the banana wrap. And then when you eat it, absolutely tender, melts in your mouth. That's a good rice cake. In addition to the satay, you can also order kangkung plecing. Hang on, did I explain to you what is kangkung plecing before? Okay, so kangkung plecing is not sauté, it is blanched in hot water, then cooled down, served with many toppings and drizzled with some sambal plecing on it. I'm gonna eat this saute in one mouthful. This is so dangerous. Oh, look at that. I hope I don't cross you out. Mmm, yummy. That's a delightful lunch. But the most popular dish in Lombok is none other than ayam taliwang. The dish was invented in 1970s. It is named after Karang Taliwang village in Matara, the capital of Lombok. The chicken are free range and may be smaller but contain less fat and are a lot more tastier. Once the chicken is grilled halfway, it's later removed from the grill and tenderized with a pestle. For flavor, the chicken is deep in cooking oil. After several seconds in the oil, it's covered in spicy sauce of garlic, chili and shrimp paste. Then it's ready for the final grill or fry, depending on how you want the chicken cooked. Time to put the dish to the test. Even though it did not went through some marinade process, you can see the flavor all the way through the meat. Mmm, it is delicious with the capital D. The side dishes that go along with ayam taliwang is the type of menu served in Lombok cuisine. Another kangkung plecing, babaruk and cucumbers are served to cleanse the palate and balance the heat from the sauce. I ordered the plecing one and it's more spicy than the taliwang sauce. My tolerance for spicy food is quite high, but if you can't take the heat, try the taliwang one. It tastes just as good.
This concludes the whole journey that I had in Lombok. In between the sedating panoramic nature, their cultural heritage and their delectable food, I feel like there are more gems hiding somewhere, waiting to be found. And that's what makes Lombok irresistible. <laughs>